Hi there. So I guess I want to talk about life on the psychic planes. If you're clairvoyant out there, then this video is for you. So most of the time clairvoyancy energy is like fuzzy color, like a varying brightnesses, right? Depending on the vibration of the being, if it looks like a little diamond, then it's a very high vibrational being. And if it's just smoky black, then it's a low vibrational being. And so most of the time we just see things as smoky color. And uh, so if you want to fight on the psychic planes, then I have a technique that I'd like to share with you. A couple of techniques. The first is Sudhistra. Now Sudhistra is a great divine weapon that Shiva carries. A gift from Vishnu. And you can see it as a disc on his finger. It's uh, not in the dancing pose, but in uh, most other depictions of Shiva, he has a spinning wheel of fire. And this is Sudhistra. It's a great divine weapon. And so I just tear my smoky being others in pieces with Sudhistra. But uh, if you're more of Christian uh, orientation, then you might want to use the Sword of God. Two swords in the Christian denominations. Uh, the Sword of Christ, as when he returns and does battle with Satan. And uh, Archangel Michael's sword. So choose from either of those with two weapons. <clears throat> the second technique is something that I was have inherited. As, and I know this only my friends are going to see this. So I'm happy that only my friends get to see it. And that is uh, erasure. So you erase the other in your space. Now you must practice it in your space, in your space, in my practice only, in my space only. You don't do this in other people's space, but you uh, match the energy. And then you like kind of lock the matched energy in place and it uh, erases it. And so that's how you do that is you intend to put that color energy in the same space that that color energy occupies, like black, the low vibrational beings. And then you just intend to click it in place, intend to overlap the two, intend to merge the two. And uh, that will take care of it. <laughs> that will take care of bad energy, of demonic energies, low vibrational energies, as I said, low vibrational energies. But it will take care of high vib vibrational energies too, purples and uh, indigos and... It won't take care of like a diamond, a high vibrational being. It will just welcome it, you know, and like continue to shine. So you don't have to worry about. Well, just as, as if you're a ethical practitioner, then you will only practice erasure and sudhistra in your own space, namely the your aura. Okay, about two feet all around you, two feet two feet all around your body. And spiritual warfare is a no-no to like practice spiritual warfare. That's a big no-no. Uh, just trust me. <laughs> so don't ever practice those uh, techniques in other people's space. Okay. I hope you're well. Bye for now.